Hey everybody, today we're going to talk about EDC. I've been playing around with an EDC pouch for a couple of weeks uh, everywhere I go, including work, and I think I've got the right combination of stuff in a really neat little pouch. The important thing for me is to have items that I actually used and that are cost effective. I'm amazed when I see other people's EDC bags and the gear that they carry and they're spending $50 or $100 on a titanium pry bar that's this big. So uh, Christmas is coming up, maybe this will give you some stocking stuffer ideas. So let's get into it. First is the pouch. I went through three of them until I kind of found what worked best for me. Uh, this actually fits in my shorts fits in my jeans, and fits in my dress pants when I go to work. This was about $20. Uh, it's orange, obviously. It's got a little sleeve in the back, but I didn't want to put anything in there because I didn't want to snag. A little Velcro in the front, but this is not much bigger than the wallet I used to carry. Okay, so let's open it up. So it opens up and lays nice and flat with just, just the right amount of organization inside. So we're gonna start from the left and work our way over. My absolute favorite item is this itty bitty little flashlight. This is incredible. It's got three different mode settings, high, medium, and low. It's the size of a AA battery and it charges on USB-C. So I'm an Android guy, which means I only have to carry one cable around. The best part, a four pack of these flashlights was $12. So these were about three bucks a piece. On high, it's brighter than my phone's flashlight by far. And on low, it's still pretty bright. This is fantastic. For the money, cannot beat it. Cannot recommend it highly enough. Also in the back of the pouch, I have this little short USB-C cable. This is an aftermarket that I bought. It's more durable than the stuff that comes with these. Uh, Ankler has some braided six inch USB-C cables I think I'm gonna get for Christmas, uh, but I can carry this around so I can charge my phone and my flashlight. Next pouch over is a little baby roll of duct tape because duct tape uh, rolls up into a nice tiny little ball. Uh, I got this prefab. This came from Academy, I believe it is, but they're all over Amazon. Next off to the side, I actually got this idea from, from a different EDC video, and I thought this was one of the most brilliant things I'd ever seen. This is a little baby magnet on a ring that mates with this roll of mason line, and I put a little clippy on it. And the reason for that, you ever lost your keys down a drain or behind the back of the desk? Now you can be the hero and go fishing for some keys. Uh, a two pack of these magnets was about $7 and that's just one of those things you didn't realize that you needed until you need it. And also in the little uh, pouch to the front left, I've got a little baby Bic lighter because you just never know when you're gonna need to have a lighter. I actually used this a couple of days ago in the office to uh, fry off a loose thread on a friend's shirt. On the right side, I have this little specimen tube that's got some Benadryl and some Advil in it. Um, I have some allergy problems that sort of hit uh, right when they are least expected, and Advil because I do get headaches every now and then. So I've got a way to carry a bunch of pills in a little bitty, tiny little container. This is something new I saw pop up. These are titanium tweezers. They came in a pack of two also for about $7 because uh, you never know when you're going to get a splinter and they're minuscule. They are just absolutely tiny. So they just fit right off to the side just perfectly. And as I showed you earlier, this is about 10 or 15 feet of braided mason line with a little carabiner clippy on the side. Um, what I typically use this string for is tying office doors open when I'm moving furniture in and out because you never have enough hands when you need them. So a little bit of string wrapped around an old gift card. On the other side, I have a little baby multi-tool. This is the Gerber version that uses has pliers on the inside or a Leatherman Micra that has scissors would also fit just perfectly. 
There is a version of this that has both scissors and pliers that I think I'm gonna get in a stocking this Christmas. And then finally in the back, I've got a couple of band-aids because I end up cutting myself throughout the day. So I've got one wide flat one and a couple of normal size. And all of those things fit perfectly inside here. Thanks for everyone for watching and uh, drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think.